Hello friends in today's video we will look about Kumari Kandam a lost continent before that if you are new to this channel please subscribe the truth behind the lost continent of Kumari Kandam India is a country of many bizarre and incredible things from one of the oldest civilization in the world to the most powerful kingdoms its history is brimmed with rich culture and scientific inventions which have shaped the world as we know it there are still some mysteries revolving around our country which we are digging answers for even in the modern times this many life forms and land masses came into existence and vanished over a period of time Today we will talk about one such landmass which lost its presence in the Indian Ocean. In ancient times, since Plato gave the theory of lost city of Atlantis, scholars from different countries started to believe that there are still some undiscovered cities similar to Atlantis. As a result, several theories and discoveries took place to claim the lost cities and nations. In the 15th century some Tamil scholars revealed that a whole continent known as Kumari Kandam or Lemuria was submerged in the Indian Ocean due to the rising sea level after the last ice age ended The mythical continent is said to have existed in south of modern day India and is located below the Indian Ocean Tamil people consider Kumari Kandam as their lost home continent According to them the now drowned Kumari Kandam was ruled by Pandyan kings for over 10000 years making it the oldest civilization on the planet At that time the land was divided into 49 Nadu or territories seven coconut territories seven Madurai territories seven old sandy territories seven new sandy territories seven mountain territories seven eastern coastal territories and seven dwarf palm territories but when the continent started drowning due to the rise in sea level the tamil of this continent migrated to other parts of africa india and sri lanka and mixed with the other groups leading to the formation of new races languages and civilization This is how the Tamilians claimed entire humanity is descended from the inhabitants of Kumari Kandam. According to their belief, it is the cradle of civilization, the place where everything started. However, the word Kumari Kandam was first mentioned in the 15th century version of the Skanda Purana, the largest Mahapurana which was written by Kashyapa Shivacharya. It is described as the kingdom of earth in the Andakosa Padalam section of Kanda Puranam. In 19th century, European geologist Philip Lutley Sclater came up with a new term for Kumari Kandam. He called it Lemuria as a way to explain the migration of Madagascar lemurs to India. In his theory of landmass, he said the continent was extended from Africa to Asia. agreed to the tamil nationalist belief but all these theories and research do they really have any truth in them or they are just a myth according to the researchers at india's national institute of oceanography about 14500 years ago the sea level was lower by 100 meters and about 10000 years ago it was 60 meters low This study strongly suggests that there was once a land bridge connecting the island of Sri Lanka to mainland India. One piece of evidence can be found in the contemporary times which support the existence of Kumari Kandam. Is 1.7 million year old artificial Adams bridge in the Park Strait in the Indian Ocean also known as Rama's bridge. But this lone evidence is not enough to prove the existence of such a civilization. 
For years, many researchers and geologists have looked for answers and proof behind the lost continent. But apart from this mention in Hindu scriptures, no one could prove anything on a larger scale. However, in future if anything related to this vast civilization is proven, it would mean that the treasure of our knowledge is deeply rooted in the depths of the sea. And there is so much we still don't know about our planet. So this was the mysterious tale of the great Kumari Kandam. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please share the video with your family and friends. Thanks for watching.